Hello, chaps! This is a video about me, uh, and it's gonna be about seven facts, because five is not enough, and seven looks odd. Uh, this is like a first video of me just talking to you guys, because there's been a lot of videos that I've done that's got me with other people, and although it is a variety channel, and I don't just want to show me, I want to show everything else, like my other friends and what they do and their channels, stuff like that. But I just want to show you a bit of me, really, so that you can get to know me and, yeah. Fact number one. I like blue. I like the colour. I, I thought black was a colour. I was a stupid ten-year-old. Oh, I love blue colours. Anything blue. Blue hat. Blue jeans. Blue soul. Blue everything! It's all good. Number two. Oh. I like ducks. Fact number three! I, as a kid, wanted to be a actor. And I think the first, I think the first time I wanted to be an actor was when I was in secondary school. And I really didn't know what I wanted to do as a career, so... I was kind of stuck in the middle, like, where should I go, should I do health and social care or design tech, and I didn't really want to do any of that, because I didn't really have much of an interest. I had a little interest in design tech, but it's not, it's not what I saw myself doing. But when I did my first drama lesson, I was like, oh my god, this is amazing! Because it was just so creative, and I could be another character from another life, which is like, mind-boggling that people did this for a job. So yeah, I really thought, oh, okay, this is the career for me. So I did my GCSE drama, and I got great, great, oh, great, great, yeah, great, 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 great grades on that, and, I'm, and then I went to performing arts, and um, it went downhill from there, really. It's an easy thing to do. It's an easy thing. You can dance, you can act, you can sing. You may be bad at it, but anyone can do it. But it's a very hard industry to get into. Like, if you want to be in a theatre production, then it's you against 50 or 60 odd people wanting the same job. And it's, although it's a great job, it's a very difficult one to get. And I'm not saying that you're not talented, because everyone has a talent, but it's very hard to get into, because everyone else has something. But yeah, that's that's something I am considering still doing because I still want to be an actor and I still want to do it. That's my dream and I will achieve it in some other shape or form. Fact number four. I was not very athletic or healthy or even productive. I was not a productive child. Literally, I'd go home and play games, which for me was fun at the time, but it just didn't do anything. Like, don't get me wrong, there's people on YouTube that do games for a living, and that's great for them. And that and it makes them happy. Like, I watch Markiplier and Jacksepticeye, and they make me laugh. Like, they're really entertaining. But then I did performing arts, and I, and I really enjoyed it, don't get me wrong. And then I was like, hard industry, what should I do? And then I went into something that's equally as hard, and that's skateboarding. I'm not taking it as a career or anything, but I really enjoy it, uh, it's just a hobby. And um, yeah, skateboarding is just something to let off some steam on a trick or two. I'm, I'm good at, like, you've seen how bad I am at skateboarding, but there is going to be, like, a video soon. But anyway, I love my skateboarding, and yeah, there will be more videos on that. 4.5 my hat just magically comes off with no warning. I hate my hat sometimes. Anyway, moving on. Fact number five. Um, I've just started YouTube. That is pretty much the biggest fat fact that you can see right now as you are already on the channel and you're watching my video, so congratulations. What I feel YouTube does is that it gives and receives. It's quite a good thing because you don't just do YouTube for, well, in my opinion, you don't do it for fame, you don't do it for fortune. I do it not because, not just because I have fun, but 
from memories as well in 20 years time or 30 years time when I'm a little bit older and more wiser and more successful and what the hell I am doing I'll look back on all my old videos and, and think my god you were from there being like the most stupidest blue hatted person in the world to being someone who's successful still wearing a blue hat hopefully because I like blue hats and especially this one so good but yeah it's just more for memory and I can also show other people what I've done in my life and that's it's like a history book that's how I see it YouTube is a history book for me and I can log all my stuff on that on that video or on that playlist or on my channel or on various channels and that's that's quite good uh, that's something I wish will not die when I'm gone and hopefully for my future families or future friends to see and actually say that guy was a good guy I met him I didn't know he did all these other things and I'm really grateful that I've met him and done these experiences with him and he shared all these stories um, whether it was through YouTube or through just meeting this guy which I'm hoping will happen if I ever meet those guys from the future which hopefully <laughs> it's not gonna be awkward watching me saying all these things and not saying your names but hopefully yeah hopefully I see you guys like obviously I've got my college mates and I, I do enjoy their company and they're really great people and I hope to stick with them and if I don't at least I have them number six I have this strange habit and it's, it's not like deliberate it's like I either forget or it just doesn't cross to my mind that I have it in my bag but every time I go to college or go anywhere and I make a lunch I always have an orange and I forget to eat it and it has honestly it's like the biggest carbon footprint than any other fruit that on this planet has ever had. It literally is in my bag for... Well, okay, I do take it out of my bag, but it goes in and out, in and out, in and out for like a week, and then it's just thrown in the bin. I'm terrible. But I, I, I do eat healthily, I just forget. I'm sorry, Orange. I'm really sorry. Finally, number seven. I'm a creative guy. When there's like a new event or something I've never seen before whether it's like arts and crafts because I, I do enjoy arts and crafts like just silly making little designs and stuff like that it's, I find that really fun or if there's like airsoft for example I, I've recently seen that and I'm like oh my gosh it's so good it's like paintballing but like really detailed stuff um, type it up it's really good but it's some, like, things like that that really intrigue me and I really want to try that and just to put it out there because it's not just the, the whole point of this YouTube channel is not just for it's not just for memories it's not just um, just for fun but it's also just to show you guys what someone that doesn't know a lot about the world you know weird and wonderful thing that no one knows and I do it to show you guys so then you guys can go out and say hey I've done this weird wonderful thing you should check it out as well and that's pretty much the whole point of this channel is just to show you new things and what you can do if you are really interested in it. There'll be skateboarding, vlogs, there'll also be like silly videos, there'll be some performing arts um, techniques and there'll also be like silly challenges and games and there'll probably be other such videos in the future that I don't know I'll be making but the whole point is just to be very creative and to show you guys what the world can offer and I, I really, I'm looking forward to that myself because I'll be exploring all it and it'll be a really fun adventure and it'll be great to actually one day look back and say I made that video and I can now say that all these YouTubers or subscribers I've actually met and seen that video and said hey I tried this out it's really good thank, thank you for showing me that's my seven facts seven facts <laughs> that is my seven facts uh, I hope you enjoyed the video it was interesting to talk to a camera which is you guys but it's just new for me so it's gonna be really weird to talk to a camera occasionally but yeah i hope you enjoyed this video if you did like the video if you actually thought i was interesting or weird or wacky or anything on the weird spectrum please if you thought 
anyone likes ducks, share my video because I'd like to meet other people that like ducks and we can meet ducks and watch them feed bread. Create an army. Hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next video. Ciao!